All right. Hello, everyone, and welcome to the In Demand Majors webinar series with Northwood University. My name is Katie Bullock. I'm an admissions advisor at Northwood University, and I will be your moderator tonight as we take a closer look at specifically fashion marketing and management. So before we get started, I want to make sure to note that you will have a chance to chat your questions. Um, just use the chat box or the comment box on your YouTube screen. Make sure um, to type in your questions throughout the session. So when they pop up into your head, go ahead and put them into that chat box so you don't forget. And then we will be sure to answer them doing, during the dedicated question and answer portion of our webinar. Um, before we begin to learn about fashion marketing and management at Northwood, I'd like, you to, I'd like to introduce you guys to our campus director of admissions. She is going to share with you what makes Northwood University a unique place to live and learn. Welcome, Missy. Thank you so much, Katie. It is an absolute pleasure to be here tonight. Uh, as Katie said, my name is Missy DeBoer and I am the campus director of admissions here at Northwood. We are just super excited that you're here with us and taking the time to learn more about what makes Northwood a special place and potentially your future home. Your major is your specialty and your expertise. It is going to describe what you are passionate about and what you are going to do for the rest of your life. Mm -hmm. The great thing about being a Northwood student is you will start experiencing classes in your major your first semester. All Northwood majors feature a common business core. This core prepares all of our graduates to be really well-rounded leaders in any organization and industry, regardless of the major that you choose. Our faculty are industry experts and they leverage their business and life experiences to coach the students at Northwood University. Northwood students feel connected and supported both inside and outside of the classroom. And there are plenty of opportunities at Northwood to learn and have fun. At Northwood University, we embrace a philosophy called the Northwood Idea. We believe in the power of free markets and entrepreneurial leadership to improve society and the quality of life for everyone. Northwood students are determined to go make a difference in the communities they live in and the companies they work for or they own. At Northwood, we really value hands-on experience. Our students compete, they plan signature events, they pursue internships that add to their personal and professional profiles, and you will learn skills that you never thought were possible because you will be surrounded by students with a similar mindset that are passionate and driven when it comes to their future in business. Northwood has many majors to choose from, and I'm going to hand it back over to Katie so that she can take you through some of these choices and the rest of the evening. Thank you so much, Missy. So, well, tonight's webinar is going to speak directly about our fashion marketing and management program. Please note, again, just like Missy had said, that Northwood University has over 20 different business majors. Our in-demand webinar series is going to take place until December 17th and we'll cover each one of these particular majors. So with that in mind, let's go ahead and dive into things. Um, really quick with the agenda, what we're going to focus on tonight um, are three major things. First, we're gonna talk about the major and what makes it unique. Then we're gonna actually bring in a Northwood student to give you a look at what it is actually like to be inside that particular major. And finally, we're gonna wrap it up with the next steps. So without further ado, I would like to introduce you to Professor G. Professor G, welcome. Thank you, Katie, Thank you, Katie. for the introduction. Uh, I'm uh, Srichankri Gopalakrishnan. Uh, my students call me Professor G, uh, Department Chair, Fashion Marketing and Management. Fashion, the very word, uh, instills excitement, uh, offers wide range of opportunities, and is one of the most dynamic of the American businesses. Uh, it, it includes, I would say, uh, numerous businesses and an umbrella term uh, remains one of the largest employers in the country. Uh, it's not just limited to apparel. I think it, I would say uh, maybe beauty, maybe home fashions. Uh, it extends from visual merchandising uh, into the design and it could be advertising, it could be public relations, etc., etc. 
why not wood uh, it's an engaging classroom setting uh, i would say with real time assignments and projects uh, clearly uh, the business atmosphere and students get to expose uh, get to know about the real time industry with respect of exposure to internships uh, get to visit trade shows and we have a bunch of speakers from the with the fashion industry uh, visiting our campus and uh, giving lectures one of the most uh, sought after events uh, with the department is the student run fashion showcase where students get to know about the transition right from the design stage to until it the collection reaching the fashion uh, runway shows course experiences clearly uh, immerse students into the ever changing business um, fashion is an ever changing uh, environment uh, it's not just within the america i would say around the globe so it offers uh, in i would say insights the department courses are very well offering insights ranging from textiles pattern analysis and detail buying uh, the course um, curriculum facilitates i would say application of concepts uh, with industry internships and projects okay thank you so much professor all right i'm back in all right <laughs> again um we're going to bring her back in at the end so feel free to use that chat box um and ask questions uh so without further ado let's go ahead and introduce our next guest hannah um, she is a student here at Northwood University and is actually a fashion marketing and management major. So welcome, Hannah. Go ahead, take it away. Hello, everyone. Thank you for having me tonight. So as she said, my name is Hannah Novacic. I am a senior here at Northwood University, and I am a fashion marketing and management major. Um, I've always been passionate about fashion ever since, probably fourth grade. I knew I wanted to go into something that had to do with fashion and business and kind of working on the corporate side of fashion. Um, and growing up in Midland, um, I've always heard amazing things about this campus and how they have such a strong background in business and in the business industry. and the success rate of students after they graduate is exponential. And I just knew I had to go to this school, even though it was in my backyard. Um, that didn't matter for me because of all the amazing things Northwood has to offer. With that being said, um, I knew I wanted to go here because of the business and the fashion. And it just has an incredible fashion program and as well as that fashion show that Professor G talked about, it's not only for the students and the faculty, it's for the Midland community as a whole and as well as outside viewers from, you know, different states also sometimes come to that fashion show as well. So we take it very seriously and it is a very big deal to all of us here at Northwood. And I love this school. Um, and I can't wait to see where my future takes me with this degree. And I know that Northwood has truly prepared me and being in this fashion program has prepared me for any venture I decide to take after I graduate. All right, awesome. Well, thank you so much for that information, Hannah. I really appreciate it. Um, so let's go ahead and let's really kind of dig into um, kind of the question and answer part. I think we can get a lot of additional information from this. So let's go ahead and bring back in Professor G and Hannah is still with us, so fantastic. And I, I'd actually like to chat a little bit first about the program before we get into any of um, our viewer questions. So Hannah, if you don't mind, I'd actually um, like to start with you uh, since you just ended. Um, so can you kind of tell us um, maybe of a favorite class or assignment that you've been involved in and why did you like it so much? Yeah, so actually last year, my junior year, I was taking a visual merchandising class for fashion. Um, I absolutely loved it. The class kind of teaches you how to set up a store and the displays appealing to customers and viewers to get them in the store and to buy your product. 
And one of the projects we ended up doing was setting up a kind of display. Um, if you're from the area, I'm sure you've heard of it. It's called Mannequin Night. Um, so we always do that. And it's just great to see like what you learn from that class, like actually apply it and actually do something about it. And taking that class actually made me realize that I want to go into something to do with visual merchandising. So um, it's probably my favorite class. I wish I could take it again. <laughs> this oh, really what Hannah said. I just want to add to what Hannah said uh, with respect to visual merchandising. It's one of the uh, most sought after courses where students get to apply the theoretical concepts they study during the course. Yeah. Okay, very cool. Um, Professor G, I want to ask you a question now. I'm going to just go back and forth between you two as well. Um, mm -hmm. So I think we get a lot of students who come in and who wonder, you know, should I double major? Should I major? Should I minor? So can you suggest a good minor that goes along with fashion, marketing, and management, or possibly even a double major for a student looking to get into this field? I would say um, most of these students um, go for um, entrepreneurship or marketing, international business. So that goes along because um, given that business is more fear and um, it being passion as a, I would say, wonderful program to explore as an entrepreneur, uh, I would say going along with entrepreneurship or management marketing would be a good option yeah okay awesome fantastic so i'm actually not going to bounce it off to uh hannah again i kind of want to follow up with that um so i know you mentioned international business professor g so are you saying that there are opportunities um outside the us for this particular major and if so can you give us any examples of where students have gone from Northwood on to, let's say, into a different country or into an international company? Fashion, I'd say, definitely it's a global opportunity. Um, and we have a study abroad program uh, partnering with Florence University of Arts, the way the students get to learn about um, the Italian fashion industry, uh, the big uh, making made in Italy concept and they get to explore I would say the various Italian fabrics and Italian leather products not just Italy I would say uh, given a fashion business one of the dynamic across the world uh, exposure definitely it's uh, an exposure gives students an exposure in um, the big fashion capitals of the world they have plenty of opportunities um, uh, abroad and London, Paris, uh, Milan, Hong Kong. And uh, they have wonderful opportunities around the world. Okay, fantastic. And so before I jump off of this, I do have students um, that will probably wonder, well, do we have any type of study abroad programs um, that would incorporate this, this fashion major? Do you know of any, Professor G? Sorry? Or is um, is our fashion program something that uh, they could do study abroad with, or um, does that not really have any relativity to it? We have a study abroad program, uh, as I mentioned before, the partnering with Florence University of Arts. Um, so oh, okay, that's right. I'm sorry. Awesome, awesome. Thank you for reiterating. Yeah. Okay, and then um, we actually have a viewer question, and it was one that I was going to ask. Uh, as well. So fantastic. Um, they want to know, um, Hannah, have you been um, involved in like a fashion show? I know you said you did um, the, the visual uh, merchandising component, but um, in addition to a fashion show, if you've been involved in anything like that, the viewer, um, I'll also add, what else are you involved in on campus? Yeah, so um, it's a loaded question because I am very involved on campus. I'll start with that first. Um, I'm a cheerleader here as well. I've been a cheerleader all four years here at Northwood. Um, I'm also in a sorority and hold leadership roles and executive board positions in there. Um, and with the fashion show that we have at Northwood, I've been also involved in that 
all four years. My freshman year, I started as a model, being a student model uh, for the show. And then my sophomore year, I was actually the person in charge of all the models. So I was the model coordinator, making sure they all knew how to walk, how to pose, like the best way to present that show to our viewers. And then my junior year, I was the director of production. So I was all things about that kind of visual merchandising aspect, the layout, the sound, the music, the lighting, um, who's gonna get there, how are we gonna get them there, seating, all things like that. And then this year, my senior year, I'm pleased to announce that I am the chairwoman of the fashion show this year. So hard work does pay off and I've learned amazing things from this. Um, our show, I cannot tell you the theme yet. Each year there's a different theme. It's kind of a secret right now, but our show will be uh, viewing March 26th. Uh, that is a Friday. So I hope to see you all there as well. Um, it's a very awesome opportunity that you not only get these fashion classes, your first day here at Northwood, you know, you're starting your fashion degree, day one, freshman year, each year you have fashion classes and they prepare you for everything. And then being a part of the fashion show, like gets you that real hands-on real world experience that not very many universities have to offer. Very cool, that's awesome. Thank you so much. Um, I wanna do one follow-up and then we do actually have another student question. But my follow-up to that, and I get this a lot, and I don't know if any students out there feel like, holy cow, how does Hannah balance that? So how do you balance that schedule? That's crazy. Yes, I'm also actually um, a full-time manager at a restaurant right now as well. But um, <laughs> Northwood has really taught me and teaches every student how to time manage very well. There are so many organizations and on-campus activities for absolutely anybody in whatever their personality style is. And they work with you and all Northwood wants is for you to succeed and for you to learn and grow in your major. So that has really helped me um, kind of time manage and I put my all into each thing I'm involved in. So I'm giving my 100% focus on this and then the next day I have a meeting for something else and I focus in on that. Um, keeping a planner still, I know in middle school and in high school, that was a huge thing. Um, continuing to stay organized will help. And there are people on campus that I know, my friends, they are even more involved than I am. So it's very doable for anyone. <laughs> I think that's like a, a huge relief probably for some of our viewers to actually hear our students say, like, yes, you can 100% you can do this. And there are even people who do more, which seems absolutely insane. So um, <laughs> thank you for sharing. We really appreciate it. Uh, Professor G, I'm wondering if you can answer this next question. And that is from Kate. And she asked, if I were to have a regular marketing major instead of a fashion marketing major, would I still be able to find um, a job in the fashion realm or a fashion marketing job specifically? What are your thoughts on that? Absolutely, yes. Uh, we have, I'm saying, our code are aligned with respect to core I mean, the core concepts of marketing and specifically focusing on in the in the fashion business so you should be able to do very well if you have a regular marketing major and find a fashion marketing job with interest from fashion okay that's wonderful it's really good to know hopefully that helps to answer that question um so i think at this point um I don't have any other questions popping up. Um, is there anything that either of you ladies have thought of that maybe you would like to add before we go ahead and, and talk about the next step? Uh, yeah, I did actually, just to kind of piggyback off of the fashion show and how you can be involved. It, you do not have to be a fashion major to be involved in the show. Um, we have, I have 21 um, other students on my executive board that I'm leading for the show. We have a finance department and we have accounting majors that help in that. And then we have a marketing department. So we have marketing majors and advertising majors working alongside me to like 
produce this fashion show and get publicity on it, as well as we have a stylist section and productions for supply chain and logistics. So any major can be a part of the fashion show and you know, it's a great experience for everyone. So let me, again, I'm going to come back to that with another question for you, for, from you. Um, with that being said, would you say that being the chairwoman this year has to do a lot of collaboration with those other departments? Are you going to be in charge of that kind of thing, making sure that all the communication is kind of, you know, what needs to happen? Absolutely. So exactly. I'm all Sorry. <laughs> so I'm always. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm like, I don't know. Uh oh. Okay. We freeze? I think so, but I think we're good now. I heard this. <laughs> I don't know if it's. <laughs> sorry about that. Um, yes, I'm always reaching out to people. My new favorite thing is emailing people. Um, so I'm always collaborating with Northwood and their marketing department as well as their finance team in um, Northwood's offices, as well as, you know, reaching out to professors and reaching out to students. So it's a great networking opportunity and really shows you how to work well in a team. Thank you, Hannah. I, I think Katie is froze, so I'm gonna jump in <laughs> and, try to, and try to help moderate a little bit. Um, one thing you did mention is that you worked on the auto show you're obviously not an auto major. So what did you do as a fashion major for the auto show? Yeah. So again, like how I say, anybody can be involved in the fashion show. Anyone can also be involved for the auto show. So they have, I'm not sure if any of you have been to the auto show at all, but each, um, there's like little tents with each different, um, why can't I think like car brand. So I was um, a captain for Team Mini Cooper. So what a captain is for Mini Cooper is I'm reaching out to that dealership, asking them kind of for us to, hey, can we borrow these cars, put them on display, showcase them on our beautiful campus for thousands of people to see. So what I do for that is I get those cars and we're actually allowed to drive those cars on campus. So. It was very fun driving a Mini Cooper all the way from Southfield to Midland. Um, and then you decorate kind of your tent. So that goes along with visual merchandising. Again, they always love us fashion majors help with that and making it very um, pleasing to the eye to people to stop in, look at those cars, um, decoration wise and everything like that. Um, and then I'm also being that captain, I'm in charge of at least about, depending on how big your team is, to 14 to five other people, or other students on the team, kind of directing them, setting up times where you'll be a student presenter or you'll be kind of helping showcase those cars. Um, anybody can be on a team as well. You don't have to be a captain right away. Um, I was on Team Beauty my freshman year and then my sophomore year I was the co-captain for Buick and then last year I was the captain for Mini Cooper so you can jump around and do whatever you want really very cool that's, that's awesome. awesome am I am I on now can you hear me <laughs> you are you're good Katie I'm back all right thank you I don't understand what's going on sometimes with tech it's just like ah so anyways you guys well thank you so much um you don't have any other questions come so I think we're going to wrap this up. Thank you so much to Professor G and Hannah for joining us tonight. Um, and for the rest of you, these are what your steps should look like. So the first thing that we are going to want you to do is schedule a campus visit. Um, this is something that Northwood University is still providing, and we're doing it in person. So please take advantage of this. Um, well, I should say we're doing in-person and virtual visits as well. Um, but if you're able to come to campus, we are doing personalized visits. Um, a tour and we're following all of the COVID-19 procedures and protocol as well um, but we would really love for you to actually see the campus firsthand experience our entrepreneurial spirit meet the students um, and even possibly the faculty in real life if, if you would like to um, that is still an option 
Um, the second piece to that campus visit is to apply to Northwood. So if you're a high school senior or a student interested in transferring to Northwood this fall of 2021, um, we would love you to apply at our website, northwood.edu forward slash apply. Um, or you can go through Common App as well. So those, those are the two different options. Um, so again, let me just double check. There are no additional questions. Fantastic. I once again just want to say thank you guys so much for joining us tonight. If you are interested in any of the majors at Northwood, join us for other webinars. If you missed a webinar for a major you are interested in, absolutely no worries. They're all posted on YouTube. All you have to simply do is search Northwood University Major Webinar Series, just like that. So again, thank you so much for joining us this evening and have a fantastic night. Bye.